Good morning, boys and girls. Welcome back to Madam T Mathematics class. We are going to learn about division. Let's look at this diagram. How many teddy bears are there? Let's count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are ten teddy bears. Now, I want to group the teddy bears in twos. Okay, in twos means that I need to group two in a group. Saya kena buat kumpulan dua teddy bear dalam satu kumpulan. Alright, so I circle like this. One group, two group, three groups, four groups, and five groups. They are five groups of the teddy bears. Okay, ada lima kumpulan. Setiap kumpulan ada dua teddy bear. So, I can write the equation like this. 10 divided to equal 5. Okay, 10 is the total number of objects. For this question, 10 is the total number of teddy bears. Jumlah semua teddy bears. Tadi kita dah kira teddy bears ada 10. So, we write here 10. Divide 2. This 2 is the number of objects in each group. Bilangan teddy bear di dalam setiap kumpulan. Okay, ataupun kita boleh ambil daripada soalan ni 2. Jadi, divide 2. Satu kumpulan ada dua. Bilangan dalam satu kumpulan. So, the answer is 5. This 5 is the number of groups. Bilangan kumpulan. So, we have 5 groups. 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5. We have 5 groups all together. Next, let's look at these lollipops. How many lollipops are there? Can you count? Alright, I give you 20 seconds to count. Have you finished counting? How many lollipops are there? Yes, there are 24 lollipops. Now, I need to group the objects in 8s. 8s means 8, Kita kena buat 8, dalam kumpulan. Okay, now I need to circle 8 lollipops in a group. Okay, look at how I circle. Okay, for the first one, I circle like this. There are eight lollipops in a group. Okay, second one. Like this. And the final eight lollipops. Okay, here. Alright. So now, how many groups are there? How many groups are there? One, two, three. I get three groups. So I can write like this. 24 dy8 equal 3. 24 is the total numbers of the lollipops. Jumlah semua lollipops. Tulis kat sini. 24 dy8. Okay, this 8 because we group the lollipops in 8. 
kita buat 8-8 dalam kumpulan. So, it is the number of lollipops in a group. Bilangan lollipop di dalam satu kumpulan. And 3 is the number of groups. Bilangan kumpulan. 1, 2, 3. 3 groups. Now, division as equal sharing. Sekarang kita buat sharing. Sharing maksudnya berkongsi. Now, I want to divide the 12 ice cream here equally to the three children. Okay, saya kena bahagi sama banyak ice cream ini kepada tiga orang kanak-kanak di sini. So, let's look at how I divide the ice cream. The first ice cream goes to the first girl, the first child. Second person and the third person. Okay. Now each of them get one ice cream. Now each of them get two ice creams. Okay. Now first person, second, third. Each of them get three ice cream. Now I still have. 3 ice cream left. Masih ada 3 lagi ice cream yang belum bahagi. So, I take one. I give to the girl. And one to the middle boy. And the last one to the third boy. Okay. So, now each of them will get 4 ice cream. Setiap orang akan dapat 1 2, 3, 4. Satu orang dapat empat ice cream. So, I can write like this. 12, 12 is the total number of ice cream. Jumlah semua ice cream. 12. And divide 3. Kenapa divide 3? Because just now I divide to 3 children. Saya bahagi kepada tiga orang kanak-kanak. So, divide 3, numbers of group. I have 3 group now. And, this 4, answer 4, is the number of ice cream that each person get. Bilangan ice cream yang setiap orang dapat. So, number of object in each group. Dalam satu group ini, ada 4 ice cream. Okay, now. We need to divide this apples in the two basket. Kita kena bahagikan apple ini secara sama banyak dalam bakul. Dua bakul. One, two. Okay. We take one apple, put in the first bucket, basket. Okay. Another one to the second basket. Okay. Continue. Okay, now each basket has three apples. Continue. Now four apples in a basket. And finally, each basket has five apples in it. Ada lima apple di dalam setiap bakul. So, for this question, we use dy. So, still remember what should we write at the front here? Apa yang kita kena tulis di depan? Total numbers of apples. Jumlah semua apple. Tadi ada berapa apple? 10. We have 10 apples all together. Dy by, okay, how many basket? Ada berapa basket? Two, dua bakul. Kita bahagi dalam dua bakul. And equal to, let's look at how many apples in each basket. Dalam satu bakul ada berapa apple? One, two, three, four, five. So the answer is five. Okay, that's all for today. 
I hope that you can understand. Thank you.